Hello. Uh, today we're going to be going to Newport Harbor in uh, Newport Beach, California. Uh, specifically, we're going to be launching here from the Coast Guard Station, uh, but we'll come back to that. Um, as you can see, Newport Harbor is huge. Uh, there's no way that you could cover all of this from any one spot. Um, and it's a really popular place for people to go. It's It's been a popular fishing spot ever since it was created. Um, and the reason is there's a lot of fish there, but it also gets a lot of fishing pressure. And so you really have to be at the top of your game uh, to do well at Newport. At least that's been my experience. I've been there several times. I've never caught more than a handful of fish on any given session um, until last weekend. Uh, my buddy Bass and Rich uh, gave me some tips and uh, helped me have uh, a really good day there. Um, one of the problems with Newport is parking. Uh, as you can see, it's really densely populated and um, there are not a lot of places to park. Uh, there's um, down at this end, there's metered parking that you can find, uh, but the meters are all limited to a couple of hours. And so uh, it gets to be tough. Um, you, there is free parking at the Coast Guard Station, uh, which makes that one of the most popular places, obviously. And it also gives you good access uh, out to the into the jetties here. Um, if you want to fish out this way, uh, a lot of uh, big halibut have been caught in here. Um, and it gives you access to the open water here and uh, Balboa Island. Um, if you want to get back into this uh, part of the harbor, uh, you're going to need to find a place to park um, along here or, um, you know, in one of these residential areas or, um, you know, fight the meters and, uh, you know, you got to pay every couple of hours. So let's uh, go in a little tighter here and uh, look at the main body here. One of the things that makes Newport unusual are all of these uh, open water boat moorings and um, you can see the boats move around a little bit in the satellite pictures. Um, you'd think that these places would be fish hotels but in my experience, they're really not. Um, I've never really done well inside the, uh, the, the boat moorings. Maybe other people have, uh, but for me, they've just uh, never really paid off. I've done a lot better um, in the open water out here, to be honest, and uh, in the open water here, and um, in the channels, and uh, actually do better in the middle of the channel a lot of times, most of the times, than uh, up hard in the structure. Uh, which makes Newport a little uh, different that way uh, from other places. Um, as you can see, there's a nice beach here at the Coast Guard Station. Uh, there's showers and bathrooms as well. Let's uh, take a look at Google Maps. And let's drop our little guy in here. Uh, the Coast Guard Station is known uh, to Google Maps, and so uh, you won't have uh, any trouble uh, finding it. Harbor Patrol, and you can park right in here. Uh, the parking lot opens at 6 until 8. Um, and you can get there a little bit early, but uh, I wouldn't push it too much. One of the things I want to mention about uh, work in the open water is just because there's no visible structure it doesn't mean that there's uh, no structure on the bottom. And that's really what makes these open areas uh, so productive is there's eelgrass beds and there's piles of rocks. And um, what this means is when you get on the fish anywhere in the open water, well, when you catch a fish, you want to try to work that area because it means that uh, more than likely there's some underwater structure there and it could very well be holding more uh, than just one fish. And so let's uh, go get out on the water and see how it goes. Okay, Newport with Bass and Ridge. There. It is six o'clock in the morning. Here we go. There's a fish. Nice. 
Gunkbuster, Calico. Not a big fish, but I'll take it. There we go. There's a fish. Got him on the drop. Body. There we go. There's a fish. Hey, there you go. Little barred sand bass. So, three fish, three different bass. Hey, it's Bass and Bob. <laughs> there we go. There's a fish. Oh. Sneaky calico. This is a fish. I hit hard. There we go. No. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, this is a fish. Oh, he's taking line. That's a nice fish. There we go. There's a fish. Right out in the middle.
was up there. Sand bass. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Forgot to put my uh, lock on. There he is. Little spotty. Like when you're driving, you have to have your license on. That's a fish. All of it. There we go. There we go. It's a nice fit.
bird stand out. There we go. There's a fish. <laughs> There we go. There's a fish. There's Bob. He's catching. Get him. Get him, Calico. That's the third one I've caught today. There we go. Oh. Yep. Got it. Oh, man. <laughs> got him. <laughs> Third bite's the charm. Yeah. Oh, this is a better fish. <laughs> He's interested. <laughs> yeah, right. Like you're trying to kind of eat that freaky big fish. Oh my god. Oh, I got that on video, dude. Yeah, that's a nice calico. Oh, There we go. 